what is up there guys, Doxville Hunt, and today is episode 18 of NHL 14, be a GM with the Ottawa Senators. So the last episode, what we did is, we, well, first of all, we are finished year two, and we're starting year, well, never mind, we're still, this is year two drafts, I think, wait, yeah, this is year two drafts, we're done year two season-wise, but this is year two's draft. And we're going to start year three soon enough. So last episode, what we did is we did the drafts. And to be honest, we didn't draft anyone good enough. But what we did last video, last video and what you guys probably question a lot is, why the hell did we trade Callahan for basically nothing? Well, first of all, Callahan, he is a guy that was getting paid $5.5 million, And I only wanted him for depth and just to, you know, make the team move on. Because he has the experience, he's old enough, and, you know, whatever. But the thing is, I traded him for our first round of the, well, the this year's draft, so 2015. And I traded one for next year of 2016 from the Florida Panthers. What I, th what I thought about that is, I thought that Florida was going to do bad. Uh, well, I was thinking that since Florida did bad this year, they're probably going to do bad next year. And this year, they ended up with, uh, well, was it, what it, another team ended up with Florida's third overall pick. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to trade them for their 2016, and they'll probably do bad again. So I might end up with a top 10, top 5 overall. So that's what I was thinking. And anyways, we don't need Callahan. And we always, we always have the free agency to come up, and we needed the cap space. So this episode, what we are going to do, we are going to do the re-signing stage and maybe even start the free agency. But uh, if we don't have enough time, we'll do the free agency and the preseason next video. So let's do this. Let's start the re-signing stage. So let's do this. Installing, yes, I know what everything means. And that's probably going to pop me pop me up a message. Uh, today is beginning yada yada yada. Yeah, five skaters about to become restricted free agency. Including Jonathan Huberto, Jason Spezza, and a lot of our good players. So let's just go to the contract screen. There we go. Okay. Did any players jump from that time? Nope. People stayed the same. Yeah, because um, for them, whatever, for the jumps, players, they jump after the NHL season playoff is done. They'll jump there. And then after they'll jump during the contract signing and during the free agency, and then their final jump they will jump before the preseason starts. So there's three jumps during. So I just want to check if anyone jumped. Yeah, no one, no one jumped. I'm hoping Aaron Eckblad jumps a lot, and I'm hoping Cody Ceci jumps to a top six, top four defender or defenseman. Cause it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Okay, so who the hell do we have to re-sign this year? I know Huberto and Spezza need a re-signing, but who else? A lot. Not that much money, not that much, not that much, not that much. F all, F all, F all, F all. A lot. I'm pretty sure he wants, like, close to 6 mil for an extended period of time, and that's it. And I'm pretty sure we have Craigie that wants to re-sign to Craig Anderson, yep. And we have 24 mil going into the resigning stage. So, I don't know. It's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. So, majorly, what I want to do is see if anyone... Wait. Uh, I want to see if... I think, we, yeah, we drafted three stars. Yeah, okay, so, there no one offensive to a, to a forward and a playmaker. Might just draft... Might, this, might just sign the 19-year-old. Send him to the... Whatever, the um, uh, CHL. And he can play from there. And other than that, no one else to resign from the free uh, from the draft. So let's do this. Let's resign some people. I'm gonna start off with Huberto because that is our main guy for next year. Probably gonna be our captain of the future. Negotiate new contract. Uh, there we go, Huberto, man. Okay, so eight years, eight mil, new no way there, buddy. Uh, okay. So he wants two years. If I can go three years, it goes lower. If I can go four years, it goes up more. If I go five years, that would bring him to 27 years old. And it will bring us to 6.3. So, what if I go four years? What if I go f five years at six? Leave it at six. And leave it at, at six mil for five years for Jonathan Huberto. 
I know it's risky, but uh, my yeah, I'm finishing in three years. I'm finishing this gem mode in three years, so might as well just go four years. Or I don't know. That's what I was thinking. Maybe finishing uh, in three years, so do five years of Ottawa and then do another gem mode, or I can go even more if it's going good. Uh, so five years at six mil. Mm, that brings us twenty-four minus six. That brings us to an eighteen mil. We gotta sign Jason Spezza. They gotta sign Craig Anderson. Then other than that, should be fine. You know what? We're gonna go four years. Brings us up to twenty-six. We can see where he's at, and we can save some money. Uh, save three hundred thousand. Go sign him at six point. Let's go three hundred lower. There we go. Four years at five point six mil. Uh, let's go. Yep. Uh, what else? Jason Spezza. He's going to want another big contract. Whew, Jason Spezza. Somebody's being a little bit greedy there. Holy shit. Even Jonathan Huber doesn't want that much. So what's my best option? Best option is signing three years. Four years brings three years brings us at 35. He might not be that good again. Four years brings us at 36. He might be done his... Nah. Three years would be a safe cause for Jason Spezza. Let's go... 400 lower, see if he can accept that. Or you know what, let's go 500 lower. No, nope. yeah, let's go 500 lower. 500 grand lower. There you go, Jason Spezza. Uh, who else? None of these guys are important, and we want to sign Craig Anderson. I could always... Craig Anderson's an elite goalie. He's probably going to want a lot to... Yep, holy shit, Craig Anderson. What are you smoking? Holy god damn it. That is a lot of people. My god, looks like Ottawa is going to the money problem. So let's see if our two main guys want to resign with us. Come on, please, Huberdopes. Please, Spezza. Come on, guys. You know you want to sign with Ottawa. You want to resign with Ottawa? Yes. Yes, there we go. We're at 13 mil. And then we got Craig Anderson that wants 7 million. Holy shit, Craig Anderson. That is tough, man. That is tough, tough, tough. Uh, what about Mark Method? Ah, oh, Mark Method. Why do you have to be so greedy? Mark Method. Who else? Uh, no one else bigger. Yeah, just Mark Method. Uh, Colin Greening, which nine. I okay, so all we have left is Craig Anderson to resign, and we can go in and sign us, sign everyone else. How much do we have? Uh, we got 37. Yep, okay, so we have uh, 37 players signed, so was it 49 the maximum? I don't want to see the progress report, so let's just go. F no, no, no. Yeah, there we go. Resign player, and then we can go resign Craig Anderson. Oh, Craig Anderson, man, you want a lot of money there, buddy. That's a, that's a tough call, man. That's a tough call. But so anyways, if I want to go up, he's going to want more. Like, even really, 8 years for 9 million, that's going to bring you to, like, freaking 42 years old. No, no, no. Now there, buddy. One. Sign you for 2 years at 7. No, we're going to go 500 lower. Nah, we can go. If I can probably bring him. If I can sign him at 6.2. Let's see if he can accept 6.25. 6.225. See if he can accept that. And then we can trade him another day or during the season. And yeah, so let's just check it out. Come on, Craig Anderson. We know you know you want to resign with Ottawa. You know you want to resign with Ottawa. There we go. So he just wanted to suck some cash out of us. That's all he wanted to do was just suck out some cash. That's it. Oh my god. Okay. Now it's the hard part, and that's resigning everybody else. Which I do not know if I can resign Mark Method. So we're gonna do the old fashioned way. Uh, one, two, three. F Ooh, next year, man, we got McCulloch getting resigned and got 23 mil. Oof. That's hard, man. That's hard, hard, hard. Because you gotta look at long term. Yes, yeah, yes, you'll have enough space now. But when you go look at long term, might be a good idea, not good idea to give him a big boy contract. So McCulloch's good for one more year. I'm hoping to trade him for something better. Ooh, McCulloch, so that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
10, 11, 12. So Colin Greening would be a good idea to resign. A good idea to resign Colin Greening would be to a defender. I mean, to a forward. Uh, what's good about him is basically he's a good guy overall. Uh, defensive awareness not that good, but also he doesn't want that much, so we can re resign him. So yep. Uh, Colin Greening. But when I want to check my defense, also defense one. Two, we got Victor Henman also going in next year. Two, three, four, five, six. I might not even need Mark Method. Yeah, I might not even need him anymore. If I can get, yeah, Mark Method. What's good about what's good about Mark Method? Shooting not the greatest, but he's got a, he's got good power puck skills. No, I'm not. Let's just, he's a defensive defenseman. Well, he's a defenseman, so don't really mind about puck skills and sense. Well, essentially, I only care about the uh, the discipline. So, skating, defense. Well, yes, you need a lot of skating, but it's defense. Uh, physical, he has a good physical category. Defense, he's got a good defensive awareness. Well, not that bad of defensive awareness, but if I look, go look at Eric Ryba, he has about the same thing. He's even better than Mark Mathot, almost. Yeah, so the only thing that brings down... The only thing that's different about... about uh, Eric Griba and Mark Method is basically the skating. Yeah, skating's a little bit better with uh, Mark Method and the disciplines. Wait, uh, yeah, discipline wise, poise wise, puck skills don't mind. Shooting wise, uh, was it Mark Method? Yeah, Mark Method. Okay, what am I go look here? Uh, oof, Eric Griba's got it better. And physical wise, Eric Griba's got it better. He's got a little bit better. Uh, yeah, so you know what? We don't even need Mark Method. So Mark Method, that's the guy I'm going to be holding back. And I hope, and I hope, you see, he just jumped again, Cody CC. And I hope Cody CC is going to bring us somewhat of a top six defender so we can replace Mark Method. He's, he's even rated top six defend, uh, uh, top six defenseman. Okay, was that? I have to, no, I don't want to buy a player. Hell no, I'm not buying out Cody CC. So Mark Method, it's a guy that we will be looking at after. So let's just now who do I need to resign? I wanted to resign Colin Greening. Colin Greening, you're gonna want no one year, two years, two years bring us at 31. He is might not even he's not probably not gonna get better, but he's a good guy. He's a third uh, checking line, so we're just gonna bring it to let's see 1.4. 1.4, there you go, and uh, Eric Condra, I hope it's a two-way contract, yes, no, 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 one year, one year with Eric Condra, but yeah, one year, no, two years, brings us at 30, we'll give you 900, there you go, who else, who else, mm. Pajot, I don't really need anymore. Like, what's good about Pajot? Like, really, honestly, what's good about Pajot? Like, I know he did in real life last year with Ottawa in the playoffs. He had a couple of good games, but now, whatever, if you look at him in this game, he's not hes not showing us some stats. I see it. Did we play him last year in the AHL? Yeah, NHL, no. Was he scratch? No, no, never mind. AHL. 15 games, 3 goals. Yeah, I don't know, 69? Nah, yeah. Whatever. We'll see, we'll see. Obviously, Shane Prince going to resign. Shane Prince will give you three -week, uh, I mean, three-year contract at 5. A 0 0.575. There you go. And uh, who else? Let's just advance one day, see how much we have left for cap space-wise. Yes, thank you, thank you, and yes. Obviously, they they want to be greedy. So, Colin Greening, you're going to get one year at 1.5, and that is my final offer for you there, buddy. Eric Condra. He's, he doesn't want a two-way contract, but he is good when you need him. Like, when once someone gets injured in a playoff, he can come and replace that player. So, that's why I'm going to sign him two years at... 
0. 0. Uh, 900. 990 to be precise. Uh, how much time do we have left? We have three more days. And who do we have to resign? No major players. So let's go advance next day. Whoa. Okay, good. Really, Colin Green? Are you going to be that greedy? Holy shit. You lucky we have enough money. You are lucky we have enough money. Colin Greening. Two years, man. Two years. I, I, so I know last time I said final offer, but this is my final offer. 1.6. If you don't accept it, it's going to be tough letting you go there, buddy. Well, not that tough, but like, come on there, buddy. Uh, who else do we have to resign? Uh, Kramer. Kramer. He's good. Grinder. Pajot. Might want to resign Pajot, anyways. Uh, it doesn't matter. Could be there for just like whatever. And then Mark Stone. Obviously, gonna resign Mark Stone. Mark Stone, you're gonna want. Let's just give you. Let's just give you three years at this uh, this amount of money. Yep. And how many how many spots do we have left on the team? We're at 40, so we should be good. Uh, resign player. Who else do we have left? Do we have enough players? Do we have enough space to resign these guys? Oh, I still got damn. I still got my defensive defensive core to look at. Uh, defensive core. Okay, one, two, three, four, mm, four. No, Mark Methal will decide at the last day. So if we go three, four. Five, six. Where's Cody Cece? Okay, let's go six. Then go one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, six, seven. No. Oh. Yeah, Pokey. Aaron Eckblad, I think he's playing one more year in the CHL if he's not playing on the NHL team. So if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so we're going to have to sign Benoit. Probably going to have to get a defensive guy in the free agency. So, Benoit will sign you a one year at uh, this amount of money. Yeah, we have no one else that's worth signing for defense. Uh, maybe McCoy Urkamps. Uh, what's good about McCoy Urkamps? Mm, looks like his shooting category is going to go much better. Uh, skating. He could be a potential guy in the future, but he's not going to be playing because he's 20. So... Mm. No, no, no. All these guys, no. No, no, no. Okay, one more year. Let's go check. We got three more days. Let's go check if these people want to resign with us. Today is the final day of resign phase. Yes, we know that there, buddy. Let's just check if some of our people... Dude, did some of our people, like, accept our contracts? Okay, good, good, good. Okay. Uh, Pajo... Mark Method. If we sign Mark Method, what he's going to be on the top six, but will we be playing Cody CC? So I'm looking at that. Maybe get off Mark Method. We'll bring Mark Method out of our team because three million for that, and he's 30. Eh, it's not that bad, but I rather rather have enough money going to the free agency than to resign Mark Method. So. Final decision is to let go of Mark Method. You've did your time in Ottawa. You've did good. You almost won a Stanley Cup, but or you almost won a Stanley Cup in Ottawa. But at the end of the day, we're gonna have to resign you. Joking. I was joking completely there. Uh, we're gonna have to let you go. Tough business, man. Tough, tough, tough business. If you're if you're gonna ask for about a million or million to two million then I would have resigned you but no you want three million close to four million so no bye 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 mark method okay so Kramer Pajot resign just for backups just in case how much spot do we have left uh, we're at 43 uh, yes 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 we know that thank you uh, 43 two more guys 45 they're gonna have um, about four more guys going four more spots going into the free agency so go to contracts and there you go. Uh, two Kramer. You know what? Who else? Wait, wait, dude. Uh, what about the guys I drafted? 
go. Who else? Uh, you know, Nikolai Goldobin, we will... You know what? We'll sign this guy. Nikolai Goldobin. Yep, that should be good. He could possibly, possibly be a player that's probably going to be in our third line of the future, maybe. Uh, but it's going to take some time. So we will... But he can play in our uh, AHL team when he's done the CHL. So we'll just resign him. I mean, we will sign him, give him a contract. Uh, who else? I need to resign. We're up to my two guys. Do, 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 come on, come on. There you go, Kramer. Resign. Uh, you'll be getting this amount of money for three years. Nah, two years. Nah, three years can bring us that. Nah, two years. We'll give you 6.25. That's it. If you don't want it, then go to the free agency. I don't care. Uh, Pajol, I'll give him 575. Two years, we'll give you three years at this. Pajo, two years, yeah, two years, three years. We'll see where it goes from there. And then let's do this. That's it. I just want to recheck everything. No one. Goalies. Uh, nope, not worth it. No. No. Okay, we're good. And we are good. No one got to resign. Just making sure. Defenseman. Yep, we're good. Just got to check. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we're going to have to resign because our next lot are probably going to CHL again. Uh, okay, so one guy. What about our forwards? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, six, uh, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and we got some backups just in case, so we're good, maybe we're going to side in one forward for the, our NHL team, but other than that, we're sh we should be good. So let's go to the free agency right now, and we're going to probably end this video, we're going to go check the free agency, and that's about it, if I just get around. Yep, we're good. So let's do this. Free agency, here we go. Okay, so it doesn't look like, off the bat, doesn't look like, uh, let's see if the guys, yes, yes, and yes, there we go. Just FYI, I've updated our trade block based on, uh, yada yada. I don't trust you, coach, so we will, I will do myself. No, we're not getting out, uh, our first round, so you can screw that. You can screw that also. Uh, Stefan Noeson, so nope, we will be Anderson, there you go, Anderson, Craig Anderson, trading block, where is it, McCulloch, trading block, some guys I want to get rid of, because they're going to want too much, McCulloch, trading block, and they're, they'll be, they'll be going down and down every single year, so, Aaron Eckblad, trading block, no, uh, who else? Who else? Uh, no, no. Tyler Kennedy trading block. Let's just check what's second line. Yep, 27. Give it at this. Uh, any defenseman that's young. There you go. And we're going to want a goalie of the future. So, goalie. Any goalie that's 27, 17 to 27. There you go. There you go. Let's go check just in case. Serber, Serebi, whatever. Zachary Foucault, that's the guy that I probably want to get. No, no, there's no one that's good. Or even Brodar's, Brodar's son. No, no, this guy hasn't jumped up yet. Per door. Nah, nah. Hey, Robin Leonard's there. Nice. Okay, so probably Zachary Foucault is going to be our guy that we're probably going to try and get. Uh, current picks, no. Off, off, on. There you go. Yes, there we go. Ooh, Jonathan Taze? Ooh, damn. Really? Jonathan Taze. There you go. Let's go look at the free agency before we end this video, and then you guys can decide in the next video what we should do. Really, Jonathan Taze, 
They released them. Maybe they're gonna. Uh, maybe they're. Uh, wow. Looks like Chicago didn't have enough money to resign this guy. Because man, Jonathan Taze, that's a good asset to your team. Wow. Okay. Did he good do? Did he did? Yeah, he did actually pretty good last season. Well, not as good as you would think, but he did somewhat okay. But really, ten million. Wow. Was it? What does he want for one? One year. Fourteen million for one year. Definitely there, buddy. Even if you want, even really, if, you, if I go seven years, he wants still gonna want ten mil. So no way, Jonathan Days. Uh, Nick. Uh, there you go, Mark Method. Really, three teams are interested in him. Are interested in him. So I said I, w I need to sign a defenseman for our minors. Defenseman and probably forward, so just go forward. Uh, there's no one. If I can go like this, eh, Jimmy Lodge, Jack Connolly. Yeah, no one. Yeah, no one. Yeah, no one worth it. Okay, goalies. Yeah, okay. This guy, uh, rookie Halinas from Tampa Bay. Guess they decided to let him go. We don't need it. Still got our two main guys. But, um, looking around, I'm just thinking about a forward for our team. That's not worth that much. Maybe Valtteri Verkunen. I don't know. Some of these guys, they want a lot of money. They even signed uh, Nick Spalling. Yeah, maybe Nick Spalling for our team for maybe one year. That's what I was thinking. Defensive wise, we're gonna go into yeah this way right here, probably probably Eric Gustafsson. Yeah, maybe Eric Gustafsson. Yeah, I was I was that's what I'm thinking. So here you go, there you go, guys. Free agency. Uh, that's done for this. This is it for the video. Subject, guys. Amber, please subscribe. And what should I do for the free agency? Who should I sign? So I'll see you next time. So bye bye.